Okay, so when I first moved in here, it had a standard Honeywell programmable thermostat. You've probably seen this before. You set the time, you set the temperature, and then you leave it. Problem is, I don't have a very regular schedule, so the heat was coming on many times when I wasn't here, and it was often off when I wanted it to be warm. I replaced the Honeywell with this. This is the Nest programmable thermostat. And this is fantastic. Now, first of all, I have to tell you, I am no handyman, but the Nest comes with everything you need to transfer from this to the Nest. And in fact, it's very easy. There's just a few wires. In most cases, thermostats are low power devices, so you don't have to worry about electrocuting yourself. And it's pretty easy to get the wires just right. Nest makes it extra easy, though, by giving you an installation kit that not only has all the screws and parts you need, it even has a screwdriver with four different bits. It's kind of something you, you might want to keep around. They also have labels you can stick on the wires so you get the right color uh, for each wire. It couldn't be easier to install the Nest. Once you've installed it, you'll have a plate that looks kind of like this. These are the different colored wires. Nest is capable of handling both air conditioning and heating. I just have heating here, so there are fewer wires. It's very simple. Notice the Nest uh, base plate has a level built into it, which makes it easy to get it level. And they also have, you don't have to use this. I did in my case because I have a large plate behind my old thermostat, a larger plate to cover that up. So it's a nice installation. The Nest itself is just this beautiful thin little device. You plug it uh, right in, it connects very easily, presses in, and now this is the thermostat. A couple of interesting things. On setup, the first thing you do is attach the Nest to your Wi-Fi network. Yes, it has a built-in Wi-Fi receiver. The Nest uses that to communicate with you and to find out what the local weather is so that it doesn't turn the heat on on a hot day or the air conditioning on on a cold day. It actually knows what temperature it is. It also has motion sensors, so it knows when you're home and will adjust itself to your schedule. So all you have to do when you first get the Nest is set the temperature to a comfortable temperature whenever you're here. It's very easy. This just rotates, the dial rotates. Notice there's a little green leaf that shows up when you're in an ecological setting. And the Nest has already been at work here for a while, so it knows some things about my habits. So it, for instance, knows that it's going to turn the heat down at 1030 when I go to bed, because it knows it doesn't see me around. So. I'm going to set it to 70. It's telling me, okay, but based on previous behavior, I'm going to turn that off at 1030. You can adjust that as well. Most of the time, I just let the Nest do its own thing. Now, here's a great thing. Let's say the heat's on and I left the house, forgot to turn it off. I don't want to waste the whole day heating a house that's empty. Nest also has iPhone and Android apps. This is my house. Because the Nest is online on the Wi-Fi network, I'm also able to control it remotely. It's showing where the nest is in Petaluma, California, the current external temperature. Here's my house. I'm even showing a little <laughs> clouds to show the weather. And here's the thermostat. And if I tap it, it's just like the nest thermostat at home. I could turn the thermostat up and down remotely. So if I want to turn the heat down because I'm not home, I can do that right now. And a minute or two later, the nest will turn itself off and, uh, and my house will be unheated. Or let's say I'm coming home and I want to turn it up before I get home. I can do that as well. Nest has a couple of advantages. First of all, it's smart. It learns your behavior so you don't heat or cool your home when you don't need it heated or cooled. It knows the weather outside. It adjusts itself in some unique ways. They've even put some smarts into it. Uh, for instance, if you're using it as an air conditioner control, it's smart enough to know that the, cool, the coils will still have some cooling capability even after the air conditioner has been turned off. So Nest leaves the fan on for a few more minutes to circulate that cool air even after the compressor has been turned off. It's little things like this, little touches like this that make the Nest so sweet. Now, it's expensive, $250. Uh, if you're building a new home, even that's still more expensive than a regular thermostat, but not quite so prohibitive. If you're going to replace an existing thermostat, it's a lot of money, money you probably won't make up uh, except maybe over a few years in saved heating and cooling costs. But it, it does, it is really cool. The design is beautiful. And you can see its heritage. Tony Fidel, who founded Nest, was one of the early iPod designers. And I think he wanted to put that same kind of smarts into a thermostat. It really is great. In fact, even the packaging is well thought out. Uh, and, and he's just done a great job with it. So. Pros and cons. On the pros, it's definitely a smarter thermostat. You don't have to program it. It learns over time. 
It takes a, a, account of things that a normal thermostat doesn't take account of, like movement in the home and the external weather. Uh, it's done a very good job for me, even in just a few weeks of use. Uh, I imagine over time it'll get smarter and smarter. Uh, the con, it's, oh, another pro, by the way, it's very easy to install. Don't be put off. I'm not a, a handyman by any means. I had no trouble doing it in just a few minutes, and I had all the tools that I needed supplied in the box uh, with the Nest. The con, of course, is the price. $250 is pretty pricey. You can save some money by buying the older Nest, but the newer one is lower profile, has some additional features. I figure, why not get the latest and greatest? My recommendation on the Nest an absolute buy. If you can get over the price hump, this thing is super cool. How many times will you have guests over and show them your cool thermostat, huh? Now that's nice to have. A definite buy on the Nest.